So this is a great moment if you hate Rome. <laughs> so you have Mithridates in the east going into an alliance with Sertorius in Spain, and you have pirates. The, the very worst crisis is actually a little bit earlier mm. in the year 91 BC, when you actually have the Italians outside of Rome who rebel. Yep. And unlike the Romans, they do try to create uh, their own state. They call it I've already mentioned persistence, uh, ruthlessness. Um, let's also add creativity. The Romans um, came up with very creative, innovative answers to problems sometimes. So mm -hmm. they crushed the Italians in this rebellion that we were just talking about, but uh, then they end up giving them Roman citizenship. The professionalization of the army was another um, hugely important development mm -hmm. to, have, uh, to have an individual like Augustus running the Roman world. The problem that we learn, though, from Roman history is uh, when there is too much power concentrated in the hand of an individual, uh, that individual's character matters immensely. And if you get a strong man, it, you know, there are aspects that can be efficient. But if, if this person is never willing to consult with mm -hmm. others, will never, you know, listen, will we'll never get the views of everyone else, it can lead to complete uh, disaster, including for the strong man himself. Mm -hmm. The Romans were not iconoclasts. They always cared about their past. Um, but they could use it, debate about it in different ways. Mm -hmm. And um, that's why everyone sort of would agree Rome was eternal, even if Rome was changing rapidly. Yeah.